Let's go, more Elden Ring. More Elden Ring. Time to finish this game, baby. I'm hoping to do most of the side content in this stream. Yeah, I found the Shaman Village. Absolutely gorgeous. I love this. This whole place is just so cool. Unbelievably cool place. I need to... Oh, why did I... Why did I mark this? Why did I mark the... Oh, can I get... Can I get to the back of... Of Midra's Mance from here? That's interesting. Why is it so choppy on stream? I'll never understand that. I have no clue. It's running at a locked 60 for me. That is so weird. Okay. Anyway, this is... Yeah. I said it then, I'll say it again. This is probably the most beautiful area in any Souls game. It's unbelievably cool. So, I need to find a way to get there. Uh, I need to head over up and around this way. I'm pretty sure I have the way to get here. I'm pretty sure it's just this. Yeah. So, I'll go there in a second, but let me try to find the path over here because this leads to one of the finger areas that I wanted to check out. And I did get this quest a little spoiled for me, full disclosure, because I saw something... I forget where it was, if it was on TikTok or what, but I, I saw something that... Ooh! Hey, thanks for the follow, Drew. I saw something, I think, on TikTok about... This being one of the hardest, like, most missable quest lines. Or, like, a really weird quest line, so I watched it. And basically, the whole thing that I was stressing about with the map... I didn't know where the map led. It's pointing to here, and you have to go here and then here, and ring these bells, and then go back to here. There we go, there's that weird extra alert again. Like, after the fact. I don't understand what that is. Alright, so I'm gonna actually grab this grace, and then I'm gonna go back, and I'm gonna see- oh, I completely missed whatever this was. Hey, Drew, what's up? Uh, I'm gonna go back here, and I'm gonna explore the top little area. I'm doing good. How you doing? Just chilling, just playing some Elden Ring, just finishing up this DLC. Uh, this- oh! Hang on, hang on, hang on. Why is there a dude here? Who is this guy? Commander Gaius. Oh, I've heard of him. I just didn't know, like, where he was specifically. Let's go. Oh, that's a cool attack. Too bad you missed, bro. Too bad he's he's bad at the game. Okay, well, I'm also bad. Uh, maybe I should fight him on horseback? But also, maybe not. Also, I think I could just do it not off horseback, because then I can use my, my deflect thing. Oh, grab. Hello? Okay. Woo! I got iframes there, buddy. You missed. Oh. Come here. Okay, he has a back kick. Fair enough. About how I expected it to go. I, I tried to do a thing there and it didn't work. That didn't work either. Okay, all right. There, all right, there's, there's some, there's some two hits. This is, this is fine. This is okay. Everything's going great. Yo, I can see his eyeball. That's a little disturbing. Not gonna lie. I'm trying to find the best plan of attack here. I could just pull one of these. Oh, of course he, of course he did that. Why wouldn't you? No, I'm just, I'm, I'm getting off. I'm getting off. It's, it's easier to fight off, or something like this. Yikes! You missed. Oh, I tried to put my shield up for that. That didn't work. <laughs> Let's go. Bro does a lot of damage there. 
Whoa, okay. Maybe I should try to stick behind him somehow. But also not because he can do the little back kick. Maybe I do just jump on Torrent and just go full on like heavy sword, hit him in the face kind of deal. Woo! Oh, oh, oh. I didn't get the iframes I wanted with that. That's fine. There we go. Oops. He seems like an extreme pushover when it comes to actually dealing damage. Yep, there we go. Sick. Heal. Nope, that was a bad time to heal, but it's fine. Heal again, just for fun. Okay, sick. Hello. Bro. Yeah, he's he's very easily killable. This is gonna be pretty easy. Oh, he has a phase two. Okay, that's fine. Yo, he's doing the Radon spinning attack? That's crazy. That's crazy, bro. No way. Can I heal this? I shouldn't have... That's a lot of damage there, bro. That's kind of crazy. Oh, that's a gravity well. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, it hits multiple times. Okay. Come on, bro. No summons. Just you and me. War Warthog man. Bro really thinks he's King Bulban from Twilight Princess. Okay. That was a bit unexpected. Oh. Sick. Let's go. That comes out quick. Oh. Let's go. W me once again. Let's go. Wow. That's a combo. This isn't hard, it's just... just does a lot of damage. That's kind of how most of the fights in this game have been. Although he, does, he doesn't even have that much health, really. Like, I'm doing a lot of damage. He's just kind of... Yeah. Oh, 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 okay, 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 really, bro? Get blocked. Get blocked. Yeah. Get dodged. Get blocked. I shouldn't have gone for that extra hit there. Okay. Fair enough, little bro. Come here. Easy. Okay. That was a good phase one. Or at least a decent phase one. Now, I'm going to... Okay, alright, alright, now that I kind of see how the timing of that works... Ow. I was not expecting that, but it's fine. He's gonna... Okay, there's the gravity well. I just need to run away from that. I need to not be in the radius of that gravity well attack. Owie. Heal, heal, thank you. Nice. Sick. Let's go. Sick. So is that is that doubly protected? Because I Oh no. Heal. I didn't dodge when I wanted to. That was not good. That was not good. This is not good at all. Oh wow, okay. 
Why is the stream so framey? I still don't understand. The stream is incredibly framey, but it's a locked 60 FPS for me. I have never played Skyrim. I'm gonna do a, a Skyrim blind playthrough on my channel after I finish the Elden Ring DLC. Because I know I'd like Skyrim, I've just never played it. Ah, okay, I didn't, I didn't dodge that. I wanted to dodge that, but I didn't. Oh, sick. I can, I can block all of that? I thought... Did that not do any health damage to me? That was weird. Ow. I, I messed that up. I, I panicked there. My bad. I'll do like one or two more tries. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna get on Torrent and try like... Just beating him to death with a, a heavy greatsword. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Man. This is going hard, dude. Oh, he went to a second phase without even doing his little transition, really. Oh, I'm in the gravity well. I'm in the gravity well. This is bad. Okay, I'm not in the gravity well anymore. I need to get close to him because he's going to do the stupid range attacks that are so awful. There we go. Okay, that was easy. That's GG's. Nice. That was a fun fight. Oh, remember to the wild boar rider. Interesting. Both were as elder brothers to the lion, and both were cursed from birth. In spite of, or perhaps because of this very reason, Gaius was both Mesmer's friend and the leader of his men. Very fun. Nice little lore dump there. What do I want to do? I guess more endurance? I guess? Nah, let's, let's go for 70 vigor. I'll cap it at 70 Vigor and we'll, we'll do more Endurance after that. I think I'm fine on Strength and Dex, like I'm doing decent damage. Oh, there's another Grace right here. Okay, well that's fine. This is a big... Boss Arena. I guess it would have been fun to fight him on horseback, but I didn't. I'm gonna do a quick sweep of the Arena and see if there's anything to see or do here. Yep, that's how we get to the big old sap dripper dispenser. Can I see where I fought the sunflower from here? <gasps> oh! Torrent, torrent, don't scare me, bro. I don't think I can. I think it's too far down there. Uh, I see something down there. I can't tell. Quick sweep, quick sweep, tactical sweep. Making sure they're not hiding anything off one of these cliffs. Okay, we're good. Ah, victory. By the way, praise the message. Nope. Not praising your message, dude. This looks super sick. I can't see up there. That's fine. The scenery is so amazing in this DLC. But I... I would say I do have one negative, and it doesn't really hurt the game for me. It's just a little bit odd, but it makes sense because this is a DLC. But the only thing that I slightly have as a neck. Who is the. Sharp Shot Talisman. Who is this? Oh, these are the dudes from the Consecrated Snowfield. 
Just have infinite. Yeah, dude, I have a. What's what's your issue? Did you shoot your dog? Okay, well, easy. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Gaius's greaves. Why do you have his pants, my dude? Black iron greaves made for Commander Gaius. A cruel joke, for he could not wear them. Oh, okay. Riding atop the boar, he called his other half. Gaius was, in fact, a warrior of Albanaric extraction. Very cool. So he didn't have legs? I didn't notice that. Also, what was his talisman I got? Albanaric blood clot. Sharp talisman. Uh, boosts attack power of precision aimed shots. Oh, cool. The Albanaric archers were in a class of their own, and their deadly long range specialists struck fear into the hearts of men. Nice, nice. I have to go see what I get from his remembrance after the next grace I get. Gotta make a trip back to the hold. Yeah, you can get a bunch of cool stuff in this game. There's, uh, I don't, I actually don't think I have any, eh, maybe I have staffs. Let me, let me check what I have. Hmm, I don't think I got any staffs. Purely because I, I prepped this character for the DLC. Like, this isn't my main character that I started the game with. I have, like, a bunch of different characters. But I started this character for the DLC, and I built my build and everything and played optimally just to get ready for the DLC. So I don't think I grabbed any staffs, but yeah, there's some sick looking ones that you can get. Yeah, I don't have any. And there haven't been any new ones in the DLC. There's been some really cool spells, though. I wanted to do a magic build at some point. I just love doing melee builds so much. <laughs> Although they finally made magic builds even better by adding a talisman that slowly restores your magic meter over time. As it didn't restore previously. You had to like use a flask to to bring it back, and that was a limited quantity. Just checking the outskirts here. I don't think there's gonna be anything over here. I wanna walk through the main area here. No, the staffs just do different things. So some staffs do, like, there's there's different kinds of magic. There's, like, glintstone magic, which is, uh, like, star-based. And then there's gravity magic, there's holy magic, there, there's different sorts of magic. So, like, different staffs enhance different kinds of magic. Like, there's there's a staff that does, like, more damage for, for glintstone spells, or there's one that does, like, more damage for, for gravity spells, things like that. And then you can just equip whatever spells... You can like upgrade and get more spell slots to hold more spells. I think I have how many do I have? I I uh I have five right now. That I haven't sought out all the spell slots. I think you can get up to like twelve or fifteen. <gasps> oh dude, are these all scatter tree fragments? That's insane. Whoa, that's so much. Five scatter tree fragments? No suffering ahead. What is this? What is this sap bowl? That's crazy. Yeah, this outfit is very Sauron. I love it. <laughs> it's so sick. There's some incredible outfits in this game. More blessed bone shards. Don't give up skeleton. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> nice. That was so worth it. What is that bowl, though? I have no idea. Can I grab the sunflowers? I can grab the sunflowers. Let's go. Okay, so... Dude, the scatter tree looks insane. So I think that's it I, with uh, everything here. I just got a bunch of blessings so I can upgrade that. Is there anything in the... No, there's nothing in the bowl. Try grass and then fire. What? Try dog. Yeah, okay. They're lying to me? I'm leaving. I'm gonna go back to the, the round table hold and we'll see. <laughs> I love Lord of the Rings. I got I got the the trilogy and the Hobbit and Silmarillion up in my bookshelf back there. They're so good. I want to read the other books too, but I just have like the main ones. 
All right, see what I get for his rem remembrance. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I didn't use the. I didn't use the sunflower one. What really? Okay. Land of Shadow fires a hail of golden projectiles towards foes. Creates a hail of golden projectiles which are fired towards foes after a brief delay. This incantation channels the force of the scatter tree's power, and its gold is accompanied by shadow. Oh, nice. The head of the monstrous shadow sunflower manifestation of the scatter tree. Then again, it might just be a flower, wielded as a weapon. Much like the scatter tree itself in appearance, a second stalk winds tightly around the first. Oh, I see that. Almost as if in a tender embrace. Unique skill, Shadow Sunflower Headbutt. Slams down the blossom of a large Shadow Sunflower, sending out two shockwaves that flatten foes. Repeated inputs allow for the two follow-up attacks. I'm getting this one, thank you. Uh, remembrance of the... Yeah, I read that. Let's see. Uh, <clears throat> sword Lance. Weapon once wielded by Commander Gaius. A combination of greatsword and lance. Ooh, that's cool. What is this? Heavy thrusting sword, okay. Uh, weighty and capable of being brought to bear with great force. This armament shows its true potential when used to stride a mount. Gaius himself was never without his boar. Spinning Gravity Thrust, a gravity skill honed by the disciples of an alabaster lord. Uses gravitational power to hang in the air before rotating the body and charging forward. Ooh. An additional input allows for a follow-up attack. Cool. Let's see what his magic is. Blades of Stone, gravity manipulating sorcery of Commander Gaius. Pulls blade-like clumps of rock from the earth. Gaius and Radon were good rivals in their youth, and this sorcery is a product of their friendly competition. Aw, that's fun. Cute. That's why they use the same spell. Nice. Okay. Cool. Back to the Land of Shadow. So, uh, uh, I can go here. Now, when I got spoiled for this little quest, I think it said to go here first. But let me check out what this is. This is... This is behind Midra's Mance, I think. I'm gonna go here. See if I can figure this out. Why did I put that tag there? Can I go behind Midra's Mance? Is that possible? No, this is the... Hmm... There's not an invisible wall here or anything, is there? I don't think so. Pull my torch out. Or my lantern. No. Okay, I think I have to go... I think I have to go back to the beginning here. Why did I ping this? Why did I put that back? I... Anyway, let's find out. Hey, little bro. What's up? Okay. There has to be something back here, because there's dudes. There wouldn't be something back here if there were not dudes. Yeah, get back, step. Get one shot, little bro. Oh, he's getting back up. Coward, come here. Yeah, that's why I have the tree in between me here. Ow. Unluckily for you, I have a shield. Well, hey, what's up? Yeah, I, I do... If you don't know who I am, I do a lot of metal music reviews and reactions, like all that kind of stuff. And then I also stream some gaming stuff in, in my time, in my free time, which isn't much, but, uh, yeah. If you're new around here and you want to join the community, hang out and stuff, type exclamation point discord, you can come hang out my discord and stuff. Well, that's over here. What's behind it? Can I get behind here? Let me try the around the other side of the mansion, because I could not... Dude, how did you get up there? You can't use torrent. Okay, whoever got there, whoever found the way up there is insane. If there's really nothing here, I'm gonna give up on it. Because that may just be nothing. We'll see. Give me the give me the rune. Okay. Okay, there's a path down there. There's some eagles. No, those are owls. Up here. Hmm. <laughs> it looks like there is nothing. Oh. No. Okay, well that's annoying. It's very dark around here. Alright. So I guess I can't get there. At least not from here. So let me go to the Cerulean Coast. And I'm going to head to the south. Kind of like here-ish. And we'll figure this out. Because I need to go where the fingers are. Ooh, that, that's a good question. Uh, I think overall... I would say Lies of P is harder. 
if you can master the parry mechanic in Lies of P, it's so much fun. That game is like a 9 out of 10 closest thing we've gotten to FromSoft that's not FromSoft. It's insane. Elden Ring has so much build variety. Abandon here my doubt and vacillation. Elden Ring has so much build variety that you can sort of kind of cheese the game sometimes. Lies of P, I haven't looked into cheesing it because I just beat it normally, but I think overall I would say it's a little bit harder. Uh, we dropping? I think I'll survive. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I was worried that was going to be one of the... Why are there hands here? Why are there hands here, bro? <laughs> yeah, all my all those face emotes and everything are like in here and and in my Discord and everything. Oh, he's he, he's doing it. He's coming for me, bro. There we go. Easy. GG's, you're dead. Okay. So from here, I can get to the finger area. Finger Ruins of Rhea. Rhea. My sister's name is Maria, and my son calls her Rhea, because he's two and he can't pronounce Maria. That's sick, okay. I don't know why I healed, I could have just rested. It's just me being stupid. I wonder, I wonder if there's gonna actually be anything here. Or if this is just purely... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's insane. Why are there so many of them? That's too many fingers. Y'all have too many fingers on these hands, bro. Alright, we're going full guard counter mode. With this. Come here, dude. Easy, easy. This game is easy with guard counter. Thank you. Just gonna heal up just for fun. Oh, and I got my flask right back. Let's go. So at the end of this, there should be a bell. Yeah, over there, there's a bell I can ring. Because I did. Oh, oh! I haven't seen these dudes yet. These are the. These are the sucky dudes. The little slurpy worm guys. I do not want to see their grab attack in person. No, thank you. Any more hands? Oh! They're one shot on torrent? Oh, sick! I'm just gonna stay on torrent then. Oh, okay, no, we're getting off, we're getting off, we're getting off. I need guard counter for this dude. Hit me again. Got him. Easy. My goal with this is to fight the the boss that I got spoiled for me, Mother of Fingers. I don't think I could reach him, that's unfortunate. Alright. He's dead anyway. So I have to ring a bell here, I ring a bell at the other finger area, which is up north. And that, what is that? Oh, I thought that was... What? Wait, what is this? Oh! It's just, it's a, it's another remembrance. Okay. Uh, I'll take Mesmer. Or, no, not a remembrance. Uh, what do you, what do you call it? Mausoleum. Why? Why? What? Stop! Hit me again, hit me again, thank you. Sorry, you can't hit me, I'm, I'm killing your father. I had my shield up, that wasn't annoying. Alright, I think... That is all here. Pretty sure I can head down now. Is there a way to head down over here, or do I have to go back around? That's really cool. I like the inclusion. That's the second one I found. 
I like the inclusion of some mausoleums in the DLC that aren't the walking mausoleums from the base game. I also need to explore at night more because there's some larval tears out at night. But they're in they're in very rare supply from what I've heard. Oh, it's more of the sucky dudes. Unfortunately they're very weak, so I'll I'll probably never see their grab attack. Unless I mess up supremely like this dude. Okay, we're good. Nope, that's fine. What do these messages say? Try up and then gorgeous view ahead. Oh. Oh no, no, no. Applaud. You're right. That is a gorgeous view. Wow. That's screenshot worthy. Dude, that's sick. This game is just one of the best looking games ever. Quite simply. Now there's a bunch of what looks like open land here, but I have to check it out. There's a dude. The music here is very... somber. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Hang on. Wait a minute. Uh, I, I see something on the ground there. That may be an upgrade stone? In which case I don't really need it, but please don't grab me. Easy. What is this? Wait, what is this? Finger Mimic? This is a new item. Exceedingly rare to find. Light pink mushroom resembling a wizened finger. Material used for crafting items. Used by those... Oh, wait. Used... Used to by those who wish to become... Is that a... Is that a typo in this game? Used by those who wish to become fingers to induce hallucinations. They call these mushrooms the stillborn of the two fingers. That's very odd. Oh, this is leading me to where I wanted to go. I see. I should have probably gone back to ring the bell before going this way. If this leads somewhere, I'm going to go back and ring the bell. Can you not? Can you not, bro? Seriously? Let me... I'm trying to stab him and he's just not cooperating at all. Another big boy here. Hit me, you won't. Yeah, that's what I thought. So this leads to... Oh, okay, yeah, no, I'm not gonna be able to get down there. You missed. So this isn't going to lead me to where I wanted to go. But, it is leading me to a place I haven't been before. This is sick. Oh, there's a shack over here. Okay. So this was really worth exploring. Good, I'm glad I did this. Oh! Oh, we got another finger thing. It's, uh, it's being guarded by another one of them in the, in the ground. Which way is he facing? This way, I have to sneak up on him like this. Easy. Another finger mimic. So I'm assuming I'm going to get the cookbook for whatever I use the finger mimics for right up here, I'm assuming? Let's find out. I'm going to heal because I can, and I'll probably get this flask back before too long anyway. Oh, it's a little rabbit. What is this? Finger Weaver's Hovel. Aha! My theory has proven true. The finger creepers hail from these ruins. So now I must sound this one hanging bell, and sweetly cradled shall I come to be at the bosom of the exalted mother. The Mother of Fingers. Finger Weaver's Cookbook. Yep. Glinting Nail. A record of crafting techniques 
left by a determined student of the Finger Ruins. His brush with the sublime all but shattered his mind, though he was left capable enough to leave these few precious words. What is the gl oop, what is the glinting nail? Is this it? Use his FP to fire a shattering magic nail. Nailstone and a pearlescent scale found by hunting lamprey? What is a lamprey? I have not even come across whatever that enemy is, apparently. I am how many hours into this DLC and we're 36. 36 hours into this DLC and I have not even found what a lamprey is. That's really cool though. I wasn't expecting there to be much over here, but there is. This is... Ooh! Oh, it's a pushover bear is what it is. Okay. Come here. Bro. Fight me, coward. These bears are in nothing. Why are these guys so easy to kill? This wooded area is a little bit dense. I feel like I'm going to get lost. Is there something over here? Or is this just... Yeah, so that's nothing. That's a dead end. This is a wall. That's a dead end. Okay. There were just a couple bears just chilling over here, I guess. Secret passage ahead. Try to... <laughs> yeah, no, thank you. Not gonna be fooled by that. Light ahead. If only I had a bird's eye telescope. That's a view. Wow. Back to the fingers. Oh, there's the nail stone. That's what I need for the, the crafting recipe. So the bell is over here. Wait, why can I summon? Why can I summon? That's not a good sign. There's not going to be like a, a boss or anything around here, is there? I thought the boss was after I... After I kill all these dudes. There's the bell. I'm just gonna do a quick run around here. I wonder if these are where the two fingers came from, if they came from the land of shadow. Alright, sound hanging bell. Ooh, that's that's deep. That's scary. Crimson Seed Talisman plus one. Greatly boosts HP restoration from Flask of Tears. Interesting. Oh, this would go well with uh, with a uh, Melania's uh, Great Rune build. Because her Great Rune limits the amount you can heal, I'm pretty sure. It's like like Stone Shard with a faint fingerprint engraving material used for crafting items. Found at Finger Ruins. A piece that came loose from the tip of one of the column-like stone fingers that grow at the Finger Ruins. Cool. Wait, let me go back to the... Manus Metter, actually. I'm pretty sure Metter is the name of the Mother of Fingers. They say it is Metter. I thought it was Meter. But this dude says it as Metter, I guess. I mean, he's British. He's like, welcome to Manus Meta. <laughs> the exalted timbre of the bell has reached these ears of mine. Yep. I rang it, bro. Just the starry sky is wondrous tonight indeed. Only your fate shines brighter. Oh, thank you, dude. Now, these you. Let's go! Ruins map second and beloved Stardust. Think nothing of it. I have made my decision to be of help. May the gleaming stars guide you evermore. Hmm. Oh, he's got the... Oh, he's got these... Sorceries. Eh, might as well buy these. I don't have these. I never sought them out in the base game for this character yet, I guess. That's fine. Ask about the nature of the world. I fear that you have borne witness to the whole of it. The conceits, the hypocrisy of the world built upon the earth tree. The follies of men. Their bitter suffering. Is there no hope for redemption? The answer 
Sadly, it was clear. There never was any hope. They were each of them defective. Unhinged from the start. You seem unhinged, buddy. Herself. And the fingers that guided her. Well, that I believe. And this is what troubles me. No matter our efforts, if the roots are rotten, then we have little Rico. If the roots are rotten, we have little Rico. Ooh, ask about Mikola. Mikola saw things for what they were. He knew that his bloodline was tainted, his roots mired in madness. A tragedy, if ever there was one. That he would feel compelled to renounce everything. And the blame lay squarely with the mother. Hmm. Hmm. Stars guide you evermore. Very interesting. Mapped old ruins received. Check in inventory. Okay, so I got a bunch of new spells. Uh, these are all base game spells. These are not base game spells. Glintstone Sorcery of Count Emir, High Priest. That's the dude. One of the finger sorceries said to have been discovered in a hallowed ruin. Fires a magic nail that crumbles during flight. Charging increases potency. Count Emir boasts that this is mere child's play, an echo of a greater truth. Glintstone Sorcery of Count Emir. Flings multiple magic nails at the crumble during flight. Char Count Emir boasts... The okay, same, same thing there. Beloved Stardust, a talisman depicting a wizened hand gently gripping a glintstone. Shortens casting speed for sorcery and incantation by the utmost, but increases damage taken. Ooh, interesting. Count Amir was known for his rec recitations. One need only envision the romance of the stars above with adoration for stardust in one's heart to become a great sorcerer. Do so, and you will know love. Very intriguing, Count Amir. I am gonna go here because I didn't grab the remembrance from this. Uh, give me, 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 give me this. I want the, I want the rosebud spell. Looks super sick. Okay, now I can continue this way. I can go to the other finger place, <clears throat> and then I want to check out underneath here in this ravine. Try to get this map piece. After that, all right, let's go. Making good progress today. That message says dog guaranteed. Oh, I wasn't expecting to make that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Falling star beast fight. Another Falling Star Beast? Maybe with a twist. That would be cool. Yep, there he is. But it's not a full-grown Falling Star Beast. That's interesting. I should have drunk this earlier? Ah, uh, okay. Okay, that I can't... I can't counter that. Oh, that's the grab. I tried to shield block through that. Owie. Don't do it. Don't do it. He's doing it. Oh, he's going right into the... Hmm. I don't like the way his, his pincers are ticking. Alright, let me actually get into this fight correctly this time. Let's go. I probably didn't need to heal there, but I did anyway, so it's fine. I'm here, bro. Owie.
why is it why are his pincers moving like that like i don't think the other ones have done that i don't remember that i've i played this game so many times and i don't remember that that, that happening where is his where he's like clicking that's very creepy There we go. That was a little bit of a weird delay on that. Oh jeez, run! He's coming for me, run! I'm trying to get like the timings for the... for the blocks on this. Easy fight though. GG. Gravitational missile. Fires a bolt of gravity that pulls in enemies. One of the glintstone sorceries that manipulates gravitational forces fires a gravitational projectile that pulls in enemies before finally exploding. It's said to have originated in the lightless dark far beyond the home of the falling star beasts. Now I know they said there would be no more Elden Ring DLCs and this was it for the game, but it would be cool to get some some extra lore. Unlike the Falling Star Beasts, go to the dark whatever where they are from and do some of that. That'd be kind of cool. Maybe some things with Melina, with the Glomide Queen. Alright, 70 Vigor. Let's go. I'm just going to go to the Fingers. <laughs> He's just marching with his children. That's funny. Hit me again. Yeah. Have at the Mr. Fingerman. Why are there so many of you? Oh, that's kind of. Oh, that's. Oh, that's nasty. Okay, calm down, bro. Chill out. Come here. Lock on. Lock on to the big one. I was out of stamina. I was waiting for them. Alright, there's a lot of them. This is scary. Owie. Owie. I tried to jump. Didn't work. Oh, thank you. Okay. The little ones I can take on. Even in a group, I can I can take them on. The big ones with the little ones? That's scary.
How did that not hit? How did that get... How did I bounce off there? Very strange. This is a little bit annoying and a little bit excessive. Did we really need these many fingers? Like, for real, bro. This is... This is kind of insane. I don't know that we needed all of them here, but... At least it's not difficult. Any others? Or is that finally the end of them? I think that's finally the end of them. Fingers. Oh, fingers. That's what I'm saying. Ugh, that's creepy. All the fingers coming out of the fog. I'm gonna take the little dudes out first. Before I wake up dad. Is that poison? It looks like poison. It's not poison. It looks like poison. It's not. Let's keep going. What is all this over here? There's a lot of just... A bunch of land with a bunch of fingers coming out of it. And this really does look like poison. I guess it's not. Just checking the finger lands. Don't mind me. There might be something good here. You never know. What? Hello? Are you... Do you need help? What if I put you out of your misery? <laughs> Come here, dude. Alright, alright. Come here. There are so many fingers in this area, it's not even funny. Stop, 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 stop! Oh my goodness. Anything else? Am I going in the right direction? Yeah, kind of. Oh, it's the sucky worms. Oh, now they're pink? That's even worse. Give me that health back. Give it to me. Why are there so many of them? I mean, I know why, because this is the origin of the fingers. But still, it's quite unfortunate that there are so many. Oh, he's not dead. He's not dead. Bro ain't dead. Okay, now he's dead. Where's the other one? I saw another one. I saw another one. Where'd he go? Am I crazy? I guess so. No. No. Okay, you know what? I'm not fighting all these fingers. I'm not- I'm- I'm- I'm going to do what I came here to do. And I'm not fighting all these fingers, dudes. Why are there so many of them? Whoa! I got sniped! My goodness. Oh! I got sniped again. How is he? No! No! Let go of me! Stop! Where did you come from? Where did he come from? Excuse me? 
Come here. Come here. What are you spitting poison? Come here. Coward. Okay. Hello. It's not... It's not registering my inputs for some reason. These guys aren't even hard. They die so easily. Like one little combo and they're dead. Did not expect to be sniped like that. Where was that even coming from? And where did that dude come from? I thought they were so far away. Oh! That was a narrow miss. How do you see me? Maybe I should go for this guy. How? 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 How do they see me? No! 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 Why? Why? Oh! I'm so confused. I ain't fighting those dudes. I'm just running. I'm leaving. Okay, I'm not fighting the two parents and their massive children horde again. I'm leaving. I'm getting my runes. I'm ringing the finger bell. And I am going. I'm leaving. I do not want to deal with these guys. Here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Don't you have iframes if you jump off torrent? I'm gonna try that. No, you don't. Stop, stop! Why? I'm drinking my 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 thing. I, I don't care. Oh, I almost fell into another one of them. Stop. No! Yeah, let let me go, dude. Let me go. If you love me, let me go. If you love me, let me go. I'm just gonna run around and use these things as obstructions to not get hit by them and just leave. Ow, bro. No. No. Put your poison lips away, my guy. Stop. Okay, okay. Alright, well, at least... Just... Wow, dude. This is unbelievable. This is... This is borderline abusive. Let me go. Heal. Oh, what? What? Okay, so if I get hit, I'm, I'm knocked out of it. That's good to know. I'm not fighting these dudes. You know what? Tish, help me, girl. Get them for me. Get them. I don't want to deal with them. <laughs> you, you hold them off while I ring this stupid bell. Wow. Unbelievable. No way he just do just spawned in like that. No, thanks for helping out. This is insane. These are the worst enemies in the game. <sighs> Let me just ring the bell and leave. <gasps> okay. Thank goodness. Cerulean Sea Talisman. I'm assuming that upgrades my Cerulean Tear heal amount. Not heal, but like fill amount. Uh, I'm just going to take it that there's no other things to do here like the first one, and I'm going to go back here. What is he? Wait, who is this? What's he talking about? Who is this? Have I met? Oh, I'm you. Ah, who have we here? Count Emir seemed very pleased, and for that, I express my gratitude. What sword I is that? Looks Yolan. Yolan. Count Emir, the knight that sword looks so sick. Emir is a shining star, in our eyes. 
That sword looks so cool. I want that katana. Our meeting with the Count taught us of the star-draped sky. We know that we cannot reach out to touch it, but we can peer up at its brilliance and heed its guidance. We will never again lose our way in the night. I want that outfit. I, spoken far too freely. I mean, the, the sword, not the outfit. Sorry, I have the outfit. <laughs> I'm literally wearing the outfit. <laughs> Okay. All right. None of that lore got through to me, so we'll see. Mm, hello there. I heard another sound, colored by your essence. <laughs> Simply exhilarating, I must say. I don't trust Stars you, bro. Dark tonight. But rest assured, this is no ill omen. On the contrary, I believe that this portends a magnificent starry cascade. Now. Take this, my final gift to you. May you join the glimmering stars above. What are you on about, bro? Ruins map third. Oh yes, I believe I can feel it brewing. This evening is a sign of a greater night to come. About the nature of the... I already asked this, but let's see. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Although, wait, hang on. Maybe that was new stuff. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. Something about a new mother. The fingers need a new mother. The poor girl has overcome grave misfortune. Her tongue can be sharp at the best of times. But don't think that makes her a bad person. <laughs> It's no surprise her little sister, too, has a heart of gold. Where's she at? <gasps> New sorcery! Fleeting microcosm. Conjures a microcosm that pulses with a single wave, disappearing in a burst. One of the secret hallowed rites. That looks beautiful. Conjures an image of a microcosm at a foe's feet that pulses with a single wave before disappearing in a burst. The broken and discarded are fully willing to cling to fleeting simulacra, earning them some modicum of sympathy. Interesting. Map indicates a third and final hallowed ruin, distinct from those shown on the first two maps. May you join the glimmering stars above. Oh, this is... This is this. Traitor ahead. Let's see if reloading the... Oh yeah, he's gone now. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Didn't expect Edge Lord. Ah, lover. Time for Edge. Examine. Let's go. Aha. There we go. Why is it always secret passage? Oh, that is a long way down. Ooh. Snake? Didn't expect snake. Whoa, this looks sick. Oh. This gives me chills. Some of the views in this game are just unbelievably cool. Enemy short enemy ahead and short tray letter. Beware of enemy, so to speak, lover ahead. You wary of tarnished. Invaded by Sword of Night Anna. Are you what's her face's uh sister? Sure looks like it. Wow. That's a lot. That's a big combo. I was expecting her to not, uh, to end that combo. So this has to be Yolan's sister.
This is such a sick looking area. Unbelievably cool art direction. Ooh, finger mimic. Item ahead. Oh, good thing I blocked for that. Easy. Claws of Night. Claws of a bottomless black from which no light can escape, wielded by Anna, Sword Hand of Night. Engraved with a smith script enabling strong attack to launch all three claws at a target. The, ooh, that's cool. The blades are only semi-corporeal and cannot be fully guarded against. Scattershot throw. Employ smithing arts to conjure multiple copies of the armament in both hands and throw them all at once. Follow up with an additional input to throw again. That's super sick. Uh, oh, let me just check this. Yeah, greatly boosts FP restoration. That's what I thought. Okay. Uh, the Erdtree Seed of this talisman was presumed to be an object of myth. This age-old artifact also depicts the two fingers. Perhaps harking back to the birth of the Erdtree. I realize I didn't read that from the other one. But now I did. <clears throat> Alright. This is the third one. This is bell number three. Wait. We're about to jump into a boss fight after this? That's cool. Okay. Now what? I ra oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh you. Matter mother of fingers. This is so sick for real. Why is this music happy? A soul song in major? Okay, it's not major anymore. This music is so good, though. This music is so good. Already, dude. That's insane. Lego. This is so beautiful. I should have guarded, so she jumps twice. Got it. That's a grab. Nope, it's not a grab. It's just a lot of damage. Oh, big laser, big laser. Got it. What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? That's a nuke? Okay, no, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not doing well with the damage. Ow! Just one little zap. Need to get closer. Oh, she's summoning other little fingers to her? Help, 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 help. What is this? What in the world was that? I can't even see. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. That's the spell I got from him. Ow, ow. She's got a laser attack. This is so cool, though. This is such a cool... Wow. Wow, she's a cool fight. All right, the little fingers are a bit annoying. I prefer if she didn't do that. This fight is crazy.
This fight is crazy. This is so cool. <laughs> the way this music hits when you first walk in is unbelievably sick. Ow! Are you kidding me? Heal. Alright, I don't know if this is dodgeable, but... N or not dodgeable, but like... Come on, dude. Yeah, ew, she like rips open her chest and pulls out other fingers. Can I tank this? Oh, okay, that's like no damage if I tank it. This may be the best soundtrack in this entire game. What in the world is this? I'm so scared of these little fingers, dude. Oh, she's summoning more, I think. Taking a lot of heals here, bro. <laughs> help, 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 help. Ow. Hmm. <laughs> Intriguing. I'm learning her moves. So usually when she does a slam, there's a second slam or like a jump or something like that. I should probably stay close to her if I can, because I don't want to get hit by the... Pull out the other finger attack. Which I think she only does if... If I'm far away, I'm gonna guess. Why'd you do that? Yep, 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 yep. See, follow up by the. There we go. Why is she? Whoa! That kind of. That came out of nowhere. Ow. Oh, of course, now she doesn't do the slam attack. Oh, wow. Sick, I'll take it. I tried to dodge that, no, it did not go well. No, no, why is she... Okay, there we go, there we go, that was it, I got it. Yikes, that was, that was a little bit much. That's incredible. Ooh, okay, okay. I dodged a little too early on that one. Alright, she's gonna call the little spheres. If I can avoid the spheres, I should be okay. Oh, she's doing several, several big slams. This is such a sick fight, dude. I love everything about this. Wow! This is such a cool fight. I love this, dude. Oh my goodness. Oh! 
Jeez, I had my shield up for that and it just didn't work. That's... That's a little bit of an annoying attack. A few little finger flicks is going to melt my entire health. Okay, but be aggressive. That's what I've learned. Be aggressive and block when she pulls out the laser beams. Wow. Super sick. So she's very weak to stagger. That's very good to know, actually. Oh, she's gonna do the multiple slam. Yep. There we go. I avoided it. It's fine. We're good. Nope, that's not good. Oh, there's a... Easy dodge. Come down, come down, come down, come down. That's kind of crazy. Not gonna lie. Let's go. This is so much fun. Oh, oh, I dispelled the... No, I didn't. Okay, it's back. Ow, that was more than I expected, actually. Okay, here we go. Here's the... Big nuke, big nuke, big nuke. Ow, what is that? That's a gravity laser. Is she going to come down and nuke the whole place? Oh my goodness. I have my shield up and ready for this. That was, that's kind of crazy, but easily blockable. So that's cool. What is she doing? Uh, oh, okay. There we go. GG's. Good fight. Good fight. That is such a cool fight. Oh, I love that. Not too hard. Perfect difficult. Oh, geez. What a way to go, too. Not too hard. Fun moves. Easily telegraphed. Easy to learn. Only takes a few tries. Amazing soundtrack. Overall, incredible fight. That's all I gotta say. Let me up my... Oops. No. Nope. Let's get a little bit more endurance now. Just, just incredible fight. Didn't expect cave. Fingers. I doubt there's anything else here to do. But this... <laughs> wow, dude. Wow, I'm getting so many chills from this. This is one of the coolest arenas in any FromSoft game. Literally, probably ever. I don't think I've seen a cooler arena in any FromSoft game ever. Wow. That's one of the best for sure. Incredible. Back to the Cathedral of Madness Matter. Anything else I can do here? Oh, why is this blocked off? Uh, I'm gonna do tomorrow. I'm gonna do the the Patreon winner monuments, the 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 Emin Wences or whatever however you say it, uh, and then also maybe Relica. So that's tomorrow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do two tomorrow because I have enough time to do two. That's a that's a sick stance. It also puts her up super vulnerable for a a backstab. Easy. My dear star, a fine mother. You will be. Sorry, Yolan, I don't know. 
mother's strength. Ymir? No, what? Uh, my fingers. I will be the true mother. What? And Ew. Why are there the fingers coming out of your... No. No. No, dude. No, 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 dude. I can't. I can't see him. I'm worried about the the little fingers here. Bro, stop! Oh my goodness gracious. Where's he at? What is he doing? Why is he... Why is he pulling all this? Count Emir, what is your issue? What is this? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I have to fight these things and also watch him. This is too much. I haven't gotten a hit off on him. I can't even get near him. Let me get the backstab. It's not letting me get a backstab. Can I not get a backstab on him? That's a little bit annoying. Let me use these pillars to my advantage, actually. Ow. You just really just spam those two spells, huh? I mean, at least he doesn't have a lot of health. He's just annoying. Jeez. Oh, come on. There we go. This should be pretty simple. Finish him off. Easy. Nice. Amira's bell bearing, maternal staff, and his stuff. Let's check this out. Alright, so we got... I didn't read up on Metter. Remembrance of Metter, the mother of fingers, hewn into the scatter tree. The power of its name... Okay. The mother of all two fingers and finger creepers was in turn a, a magnificently gleaming daughter of the greater will and the first shooting star to fall upon the lands between. Ooh. <laughs> she was the first. Out of all the falling star beasts and everything. Bell bearing of Count Emir, mother of fingers found upon his petrified flesh. Okay. Uh, maternal staff. That looks incredibly stick. Sick. Staff of Count Emir, who made himself a mother of fingers, carried for want of tail fingers of his own. Enhances finger sorceries. The crystal ball, though representative of a microcosm, would not receive any sign. This armament has no skill. The hat. <laughs> he has no skill, too. Hat of County Mirror, High Priest. The circular design at the top represents the greater will and its lightless abyss, imparting increased intelligence and arcane to the wearer. Though County Mir instructed Relana in the sorceress arts, he abandoned his allegiance to the moon. It was merely the, the closest of the celestial bodies, nothing more. Conceals the abundance of squirming beneath. Gold embroidery decorates the purple cloth with a jeweled ruff that sparkles like a flower wet with dew. Oh. And that's just that. Interesting. Okay. I think I finished this whole quest then. Let me make sure nobody else is here. Oh. Do we get her stuff? Oh. Email the stars. The sky. I see them not. I killed him, sorry. <gasps> Ooh. This is the second person I can use one of these on. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna grant her grace and peace because she has my armor and she's kind of cool. Be at peace. Oh. It blinds as if our night simply never was. <laughs> Sword Hand of Night, Yolan. Nice. So if I use the other one, would I have gotten her... 
her uh, weapon and stuff. Can I still get her weapons if I rest the grace and come back? No. Oh boy. But I can summon her now. So that's cool. Oh well. That's a second playthrough kind of thing. And a third and a fourth and a fifth and a sixth and a seventh and an eighth and a ninth and a tenth and a however many times I'm going to play this. So that's everything, I think. What else should I explore? Ooh, wait, hang on. This looks like this could be an entrance to... Over here. And I did not explore over here. I didn't explore like anything up in this area. So let me go here, and I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to see if this leads over here. And then after that, I'm going to try to get down here in this ravine, and go up north, grab this map piece, and see whatever is down here. And then I'm fighting the final boss. Then I've completed everything. No, not here. Here. <laughs> Back to here. Ooh, 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 Statue of America. Scatter tree blessing? Or fragment? Yeah. You know it. Shadow Realm rune. Whatever. 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 I'm not fighting the flowers. I don't care. Ooh, whoa, 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 what's this? <gasps> Perfumers? Do I, am I going to get another perfume? Am I going to finally find a second perfume bottle? Heal from afar. I have not found... There's like seven other perfumes that I've seen in videos, but I have not found them. I just have the fire perfumes. Okay, I didn't want to do that again. That's fine. What? Uh, what is this? Greatly heals each HP for distant allies the spell reaches. Fires a projectile toward distant allies that greatly restores HP on contact. Even when far beyond, far out of sight, the urge will surely give us its blessing. Super sick. This was the path to here. I was correct. Let's go. What is this? I haven't been... No, I'm thinking of this poison area. This one. I haven't been to here yet. Hmm. Hmm. A bird? Oh, it's squelching. No, it's just a gravestone. I thought I saw something. It's just a gravestone. Okay. Can I lure them out one by one? That'd be nice. Let's go. About to jump this one with torrent. Watch this. Whoa. Yeah. Let's go. I feel like I'm doing so much more damage. Hmm. Oh, whoa, whoa. This is underneath Shadow Keep. That's intriguing. Ow. Ow. Alright, I got a little greedy with that. Uh, just slightly. Gravebird anklets. Sick. Oh, wait. Acquire materials? Whoa, okay, camera. A mushroom? That's where that was. Bloodstain. That's the path to um, Abyssal Woods. A couple more birds up here. This has to be something cool, right? 
it's not just going to be a path to nothing. Okay, I think that clears out all of this. Yeah. Let's keep going into this cave looking thing. Ugh, more birds. Come here. Goodbye. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Maybe this leads to where I have to go. I still, okay, well, I still have to figure out how I get that map. Look at the shadow keep. Oh, I remember that bridge. That's the rain... The raining blood bridge. That's the Slayer Bridge. Can't level up, can I? No. I need, like, over 300k to level up. Of course, of course. Yeah, easy. Easy. Just a dagger, really? Summer spinning stone set. Some misbegotten's? Well, unluckily for you, I have ranged weapons too, buddy. Can't touch this. Come here. Come here. Try me. Oh, I have infinite throwing daggers. What are you going to do about it? You're going to die about it. That's what you're going to do. Another W for me once again. Skill issue. Skill issue. Wow, I'm right in front of him. He missed. Skill issue. Skill issue. Hmm. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of them here. Oh, jeez. Let me kill the dog before anything else. You're hitting me with blood loss. Bro thinks he's Moog. Oh, there's another one. Oh, oh, I have my shield up just in time for that. Whoa, why didn't I... Blood Fiend Sacred Spear, is that all? I think so. Blood Fiend Sacred Spear, Green Spear. Uh, one of the most significant implements used in their blood rituals. Sacred Spears of Blood are the instruments of communion with an outer god. The mother of truth desires a wound. Blood Fiend's Blood Boon. Raise the Sacred Spear and pierce the body of the Mother of Truth, creating an explosion of blood flame in the area surrounding the target. Allows additional input, allows for up to three follow-up attacks. Is that, um... Is that the same as Moog's Trident? That's the Gravebird thing. Sword Hand of Night. Sword Hand of... Yeah, Sword Hand of Night, Yolan. I didn't read this. 
Spirit of a sword hand, granted light by the iris of grace, wields a sword of bottomless black that penetrates the enemy's guard. Excuse me. Though it was not by the shining star that she had longed for, thus was her night illuminated. But this was at this was an at times blinding light, and threatened to expunge the night entirely. All right. Not too sure what all this talk about the night and the light is. I think it's referring to the night of like the void where all the the star beasts came from, of which Metter was the first. Wow. What in the world is taking damage over here? Why are they fighting each other? Oh, there's dudes fighting them. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. Less for me to worry about, sure, but... Why are they fighting, though? Here, have a backstab. Let's go. Do I hear? Oh, I do. I messed that up. Sick! So this is under Rao Ruins. Is this just a cave with a thing? Sacred Body Flesh. Yeah, there's nothing else in here, right? Yeah. It's just a cave with a thing. W me? Why wasn't that guy fighting the dudes? Do they only fight situationally? Oh, you're sleeping? Wake up. I want some health back. Take a backstab. I'm gonna heal, just for fun, even though I don't need to. Oh! Hello, sir! Goodbye, sir! Ah! Oh, I missed! Enjoy a backstab, good sir. Wow, you are an insane pushover. A little crazy there, buddy. It's a Mesmer Flame Dog. No way. That's kind of insane, not gonna lie. Oh, that's kind of insane, too. W. Ooh, wow, look at that. But I can't get distracted because there's these golems shooting at me. Bite his ankles. There we go. No, no, get, okay. That's what I'm talking about, let's go. Who does this bro think he is? Almost all his health. Jump!
clean fight, clean fight. Where is this leading me? Whoa, wait, 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 maybe, 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 maybe this is going to take me right to the... Oh, I think the map is right up there. That's Rao Ruins up there. Look at that. That's crazy. The sky does not look like how it does when you're up in the ruins. Oopsies. Oops. Sorry. Yay! The map is right here! Okay. Figured it out. Look at that. Oh, wow. There's more here down in this other area than I thought. I have the whole map now. That's crazy. This DLC is so big. Wow. I am thoroughly impressed. Every time I... Okay, now I, I heard that Margit's Shackle will break these things. These giant ruins are flooded, overgrown, and split into two by a chasm. To the southwest is the Church of the Bud, overlooking the Tower of Shadow. Now, where is Margit's Shackle? I don't think I actually have it in this run. Who, who sells it? Can't you get it, like, super easily? Let me just look this up real quick. Can be purchased from Patches. Do I want to... <laughs> Do I want to go to Murkwater Cave and find Patches? Do I want to do that? Sure. Sure. I, just, I want to test this out. I want to see if this works. I'm finding Grace nearby first, though. Because I don't have one currently. Where's that going to take me? Up to Round Ruins? Oh, up to here, I think. That's cool. I got to those catacombs, but those catacombs were a dead end. Didn't this dog Grace? Oh, why can I summon? I always get extra scared when I can summon. Can I just have a grace, please? There's something up there I gotta check out. There it is. There's one. Almost 40 hours into the DLC, and I finally found a map. I mean, the whole map. That's kind of wild if you think about it. Not sure how much I need for a thing for an upgrade, but I'm gonna try popping this and we'll see what I can get. Ooh, that's disgusting. <laughs> 4,000 runes off. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, so... I'm going to go back to the round table hold. I'm going to grab the few remembrances that I can get. Uh, these two, I'm going to grab the other one because these are other things. Um... Rotten butterflies. I read about all these. Okay. So you can get Staff of the Great Beyond, which looks like Emir's Staff, but finished. Staff fashioned from the tail of Metter, the Mother of Fingers, and the microcosm raised aloft over the crux they form. Catalyst for casting both sorceries and incantations. The Mother received signs from the greater will from, from the beyond of the microcosm. Despite being broken and abandoned, I got hiccups, dude. She kept waiting for another message to come. Ooh. That was such a fun fight. Gazing finger, the head of Metter, the finger mother, wielded as, a, wielded as a weapon without modification. From within the center of the fingerprint that wrinkles the creature's foremost protrusion, a tiny wart-like eye gazes vacantly into the beyond. Is that an eye? I need to zoom in and see that. Cow Tower's resentment, skill performed as a violent bow. You as a, a violent bow a violent bow using a finger's foremost protrusion resentment builds as it is forced to bow making it explode with anger hold button down to further increased increase resentment <laughs> that's kind of cool though uh let me get the finger okay now i can go to murkwater cave oh he's dead okay i guess you can only this is a teleporter right Oh. Not anymore. Okay, I guess you can only fight him before a certain point in the game. I was not aware of that. Back to the round table. Hold! There's Margaret's Shackle. Thank you. 
Okay, so now apparently if you use Margaret's Shackle here... There we go. That's cool. Sick. Where's this gonna take me? Oh, yeah, up here. Nice, that's where I thought. Oh, look at raw ruins at night. Beautiful. I'm just gonna skirt around the edges here. See if there's anything worth getting. Nah, probably not. Based on how my exploration has been going so far, there will not be. What shall be in here? Northern Nameless Mausoleum. What's this? Red Bear? Oh, not a red bear, just a guy dressed up as a red bear. Gonna get your bear claws after this, dude. You are very easy, sir. As long as I don't get caught in a wombo combo. Hello, how did that not hit him? Oh, that's something. Yeah, that's just a backstab. Don't do that, I'll just backstab you, dude. Don't heal, don't heal, don't heal, don't heal. Don't heal, don't heal, don't heal, easy. There we go, there we go. We win these. What do I get? Red Bear's Claw, Fang Helm, Iron Rivet Armor, and some stuff. Okay, what do we got here? Beast Claw, a claw of a great red bear wielded without modification by Red Bear, whose name is Lost to Madness. After killing the great red bear in a blood-soaked bout, he became fascinated by the untainted glory of its naked strength. I wish to be a bear, no more and no less. Slaughter's prey with sharp claws and a great swipe of the arm. The attack creates a vacuum which deals continuous damage. Repeated inputs allow for two follow-up attacks. Cool. Helm of Redbear, his name is Lost to Madness. The lion cheat guards are sh oh, the cheat the cheat guards are shaped after lion fangs. <laughs> Perhaps his fascination with the untamed strength of the wild stemmed from his past as a red main. Makes sense. The armor of Redbear, whose name is Lost to Madness. A vest reinforced with iron rivets. After killing the great red bear in a blood-soaked bout, he became fascinated by the untainted glory of his naked strength. I wish to be a bear no more. Okay, yeah. And that's all the same. Awesome. Cool, 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 cool. Um, so those I got. The armor and greaves and claw and whatever. That's base game stuff. Okay. I read everything. So pretty sure that's all there is to see up here. Ooh, that's a path. That's a path. Ooh, wait, that's a path. That's going to lead over to here. Ooh, I think I checked the map. Looks like there's a thing over here, right? Yes, there is. Oh. <gasps> oh, oh. That's the painting. Spiral tree seal. A seal, sacred seal of a soiled, sacred seal of soiled amber engraved with a spiral tree design. Enhances spiral incantations. The majesty of the white tower stretching to reach the gods, even inspired a secret faith in the invaders, the people of the Erd Tree. That's such a sick shot. This game is so beautiful. That's the big old bridge. Huh. Who will see in this from a different viewpoint? Okay, so yeah, this is the top. I can't get down there. Awesome. Very cool. 
Look at that. You can see Castle Ensis. Got the castle. I mean, uh, the Shadow Keep up there. You got that place off in the distance. The giant peak. That's where you spawn in. Crazy. Let's keep going. Time to explore the Temple Town ruins. And then this is the last area that I have to check out before I'm done with the DLC, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna look up a bunch of stuff later when I'm playing it on my own and try to find any little things that I missed. But I'm almost done with my first playthrough. 40 hours in, that's kind of wild. Wait, are you are you sparkling? No. It's only the sparkling ones that give you upgrade materials. Oh, spirit upgrade. Smithing stone three? Really, bro? Why is it always dung? Shut up. What you're crying? Oops. I'll be damned if there's no way past the wall. That's a game message. How to get past the wall. So, might I have to get creative here? Not there. I wonder if there's some way to scale up the wall like I did that other time accidentally. I mean, not accidentally, I did it on purpose, but... Where it's not intentional. Stop. That's, that's just straight up a wall. I can just go around that. So... The only place I'm trying to get in, then, is just that other area. I'm just running around like a madman. I gotta try to get in here somehow. How? I have no idea. I don't think I will be able to take the spirit spring. It's too far away. There's probably a secret passage or something. Spirit grave stone, those are useful for crafting. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, whatever. Hmm. Hmm. Looking around. I think I'll be able to make that. On oh, oh, thank you, Torrent. Thank you for that. Wow, wow, bro, what is your deal?
No, I, I will not. Torrent. Torrent. I'm, I'm going to try it, but I, I have a feeling I will not be able to make it up there. From here. Wow. Nope, I'm not making it. Nope. There's no way that's the intended way to get up there. Okay. Sure, buddy. Can I... Oh, I can... Oh, 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 oh. Almost definitely I can make it up there. Yeah, let's go. Seek talisman. There are talisman up here. That, that's cool. What kind, What in the world just hit me? What kind of talisman are we talking here? Something that's useful to my build or no? Oh, it's a dude. It's a one sword dude. He's he's scary. Thank you, bro. Incredible. 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 You're dead. Talisman. What is it? Two handed sword talisman. Ooh. Enhances attacks with two-handed weapons. That's good. The horned warriors were fitting figureheads for the military might of the tower they kept watch over. Their deft attacks slashing through any and all foes. Warrior, oh warrior. Ah, two-handing, therefore time for edge. Is that all that's up here? Let me check over here. And a scattered tree fragment. Okay. And that is the end of this, it would seem. Amazing. Let's head to the north. That's the south. Wait, is this more of this that I haven't been to yet? Who are you? Bro. Who do you think you are? Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Easy. Oh, they increased the range on these things. I want to see how... I want to see how much. Oh, that's... Wait, that's really good, actually. I'm really glad they increased the range, because these things were pretty bad before. <clears throat> like, the range of them. Now they feel actually kind of decent. That's pretty good. Yeah, I have not been up here. <gasps> That's an upgrade. Spirit? Spirit? Spirit Ash? No. Silver Torn... Silver Torn Hender? Why do I keep doing that? Silver Horn Tender gotta be something up here too right this looks sick what's up here or is this just cringe precious item ahead bro ain't nothing ahead that's where i was ah that's how you're supposed to get in through that well i found the back entrance anyway okay let's go north actually what's my no my flasks are good i'm just gonna just gonna book it then there could be something this way but there's also probably nothing this way but I'm gonna check anyway because I'm thorough aha there is 
Grave Glove Ward 5. Not really worth it, but I'm glad I checked. Because my curiosity would have gotten the better of me if I didn't. Wait, is it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where the... Temple Town Ruins. This would look really cool in the daytime. And I can level up. Go to like noon. Yeah, now this is what I like to see. Let's go, Temple Town Ruins. Let's do it. Let's try. Oh, do gem. I don't think I really need those, but no, no, it's it's the it's the worst rock kindreds. So easy. No one cares. So these are, these are the ruins right underneath. Oh, that's the thing. That's the thing. These are the ruins right underneath where the Church of the Bud is. Where I fought Romina. So I wonder if there's gonna be anything interesting down here. Since the since Rao was split in half at this chasm that it was talking about. Wow, maybe this is a bad idea. Wow, wow. I'm running past these dudes. No way I'm fighting like ten rot kindred. I'm gonna drink my physic flask. So I don't lose this again. Cause I hate the rot kindred. They suck. I hate them. They're very bad. And, uh, and they're just hitting me no matter what. I'm gonna just run past these dudes if I can. I still have to go. Okay, I have to go up that. Go, 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 go. Just go. Just go. I have to go up that ramp up there. But what's around here? Anything cool up here? Cave? <gasps> ooh, ooh, a thing. Antiquity Scholar's Cookbook. The record of crafting techniques left by the Horn Scent academics who study the ancient ruins of Rao. Details techniques for working with sprites thought lost to antiquity. Fire Sprite Stone. What is that? Use this FP to release a fire sprite that bounces along the ground. Oh. Interesting. It's kind of cool. Glad I checked that out. Oh, we got another sword dude. Oh, this is a double sword dude. This guy's easy. I hear something over here. Wait a minute. Ah! Ash of War, the poison flower blooms twice. Shadows die twice? Sakura reference? Ash of War grants arm an arm at the poison affinity. The poison flower blooms twice. Conjures stingers of scarlet rot from below to stab the enemy. Landing a follow-up attack on a foe already inflicted with poison or rot deals massive damage in one fell swoop, usable on all melee armaments. That's interesting. It's a pretty cool weapon for, like, a rot build. Whoa, I didn't expect that forward dash. That's kind of crazy. There 
go. Told you he's a pushover. Where am I currently? Ooh. Grace, 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 Grace. Is that a... I didn't mean to do that, but that's not a tibia mariner, is it? It's a tree branch. I'm blind. I'm blind, guys. That's not a tibia mariner. <clears throat> okay, so I can head up here because there's a ramp back here that I'm assuming goes up to this, which is up there. I'm going to push ahead first, though. What in the world is this stupid idea? Okay. This is a dumb idea, but it's fine. It worked out in the end. Oh, I'm underneath all the... Whoa. I'm underneath the ruins. Currently. What in the world? What is this? Orn-strewn excrement. Y'all be pooping? I just walked on the poop pile. Ain't nothing here at the edge of the world. I have expect a merchant to have a little shack here. And then wonder why he gets no customers. <gasps> Rune bear. Ow, dude. I love fighting room bears. They're so much fun to fight. They're one of my favorite, like, big mobs, along with ulcerated tree spirits. Woohoo! Oops, I missed. My bad. Need a little stamina. Oh, I thought he was going to... I thought he had three. I missed that. Hello? There we go. Jeez. Nice. Oops. He's not dead. Now he's dead. <laughs> Man, there's so much fun to fight. Oh. What is this? Bro, did you not just see me take down an entire rune bear? You think I'm going to shake in my boots because I'm getting attacked by a wild boar? I swear, they have no sense of self-preservation at all. Ooh. A rock. Oh, another rune bear. When am I going to get one of these red bear incantations? Oops. Okay, there's two of them. There are two rune bears. I'm trying to scout out the area. Yo, not... Not the flying scorpion spiders, bro. Come on. These guys are ridiculous. There we go. Easy. So, where does this go? Is this going to go underneath? I'll just have to find out now, won't I? Where were those bears at? Oh. Big red bear. Rugalea the Red Bear, the Great Red Bear. 
Got some AoEs here, bro. Oh, that's quick. That's quick. Oops, I healed instead of dodging. Oh, phase two? Rune bear phase two? Let's go. I'm so good at this. I didn't need to heal there, but I did anyway. This is such a cool fight. It's a rune bear fight, but more fun. Oh my goodness, the lag. Wow. Am I gonna die here? No. Right underneath it, I'm healing. I have my shield up and everything. Owie. Owie, ow, ow. Tank it. Let's go. Oh, that's a lot of posture damage there. That's kind of insane. That comes out so quickly. Just heal. I'm going to die here and I have something in my eye, I feel like. Let's go, let's go. That was a fun fight. Give me incantation, give me incantation, give me incantation. I have to get one. I have to, that has to be, yes. Roar of Rugalea. Rugalea. An incantation of what is jokingly called the Bear Communion. Channels the power of Rugalea, the great red bear. Transforms oneself into a great red bear and emit a mighty roar. An incantation that is more akin to the divine invocation of the horn scent than it is to the dragon communion. Only through the des only through desperate battle with the feral wild can one discover a god unique to oneself. Let's finish off this area. That was really cool. I'm not gonna go fight the other room bears. I'm gonna hug this edge and see if I can find a way up there. I'm pretty sure that's the way back to Is that like the back side of Yes, the back side of Bellarat. That's funny. Uh, I'm pretty sure the way up there is the way that I came from by the Rock Kindred. There, there was a big ramp I saw. I'm assuming that's it. Oh, cookbook. Hefty fetid pot, a record of crafts and techniques of the greater potentate who roamed the lands near and far. Haunted by the grotesque practice of his village of birth, he suffered great pot. He stuffed great pots with all manner of things. Uh... Throw at enemies to cause a large buildup of deadly poison. Very cool. Some horn strewn excrement as well. To build those things. Nice. I'm gonna die here because I don't I don't have any flasks. Unless maybe if I take these dudes out, will I be able to get flasks? There we go. Flasks? Yes. Wait, no. Why did I think... It looked like he... It looked like he gave me flasks. Oh, because there's another dude up there. Oh, there's two more dudes, of course. Why has 
Why is this bro trying to get me? Nope, nope, no. Nope. I'm st I'm stuck on a rock. I could not even move. How was I stuck there? That doesn't even make any sense. Yeah, what's over here? Is that the Vulgar Militia? Yes. Oh boy, it's another one of these guys and their antics. We're getting another cave full of them, probably. Okay, yep, it's another cave full of them, probably. Stop! A virtual case from me! I beg! Look away! Ah! Uh oh. Does this mean madness? Are we about to get a madness cavern? It's like, look away from me. Ah, madness. And this is so sick. I haven't checked on my messages in a while. Where are they at? Visions of Dog and then Sadness is my most popular one out of the 10 that I have. Scorpion River Catacombs. Intriguing. Let's see how this one is. What stuff they pull here, if it's different or if it has one of the similarities to things. Because a lot of the catacombs in Steel Sea have been pretty diff- No. 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 Stop. Put your face away, my dude. A lot of the DLC catacombs have been pretty different. Also, I don't care what anyone says, I actually really enjoy these catacombs. I don't care if they're repetitive, because they're each a little bit different. And it's just really, really cool, I think. It reminds me of the Chalice Dungeons in Bloodborne, which I also didn't mind that much. I'm a creature of habit. I like doing things repetitively, so I don't mind. Oh, that's terrifying. Death Blight. Ugh. I'm getting chills from that. The music build up too? That was great. They cooked with that. A death blight basilisk who looks at you when you get death blight. Be wary of right, left. <laughs> Bro lied to me. Never trust the messages. Check the walls. Always check the walls. Grave Glove Ward 3. Alright, I doubt these are going to be secret passages. Probably not. Nope. Shield up in the corner. <clears throat> be wary of left. Oh, yep. Purple Bloom. Didn't expect lightning. I'm just checking like the center ones are the ones that are probably the most obvious to possibly be a hidden passage. Hmm. Be wary of right and then visions of up. Oh, I see. <clears throat> oh. Where? Where? Oh, I see. Stop. 
stop with the fire thing, dude. Stop with the fire thing. Stop! Let me kill this dude! Stop with the fire thing! Stop! Oh my goodness. Passage? Nope. Didn't expect dung. Dung ahead. Oh! Okay. Then this covers all of that. I think I have to run to the right. Let's go! Go, 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 go. Grab the item. Dung. Alright, there's another one over there. Wow, there's a lot, uh, a lot of places to go here. Ladder ahead. In that alcove, possibly? Ladder ahead. Yeah. Yeah, let's try this. I have to go somewhere. Might as well go here. I can definitely get on top of that. Oh no, 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 down. Oh my goodness. Where is it? I didn't even see it. Where is it? Where's the- Oh, that- Dude, that's disgusting. That's so nasty. I'm gonna check to the left real quick. Try mimicry. Safety. Liar head. What's the item you get that can transform you into things in the environment? Uh, I don't think I have it. Oh, uh, the mimics, the the thingy, and oh, I know, I know where it is. It's in Stormvale. I I could I could try that, but also, you shouldn't have to do that to beat the game. Easy. My greens. Black Knight Captain. Who? Let me try to get up on top of this thing from the ladder, actually. But I'm also scared that the second I do, the Basilisk is going to see me. So, I think we try to run for it. I think we actually do. Let me just, let me go. Oh my goodness, it worked, it worked, it worked, it worked, it worked, it worked. Oh. I may just pull out my bow and arrow and just snipe him from here. Because that's disgusting. Or wait, does that... Does that lead up? What if that leads up? I 
I can't hit him. I can't hit him. Oh, no. no. Turn back and then seek inc incantation. No, that definitely goes down. How am I going to... I'm not going to make this. Like... Oh, I see it. I see it. Okay, I'm going to wait for my thing to go down, but I can walk across that little path. I need to wait for my thing to go down, though. I'm not killing them. I'm not. I'm not gonna fight this dude with, without like a zero death blade buildup. This is kind of insane, honestly. This is definitely one of the scariest catacombs in the game, quite possibly. At least in terms of fear of death, because everything else you can basically fight through. But death blade is just straight up. You are dead. It's legitimately terrifying. Okay. Here goes nothing. Pray for me. Oh. Oh. Lovable sword to head. Are they just like this? If only I had a trap. I can't stop them. I can't... I can't stop them. Why? Alright, I'll figure that thing out later. Let me just... Get jumped from somewhere in here. No? Okay, it's just... It's just dudes. It's just statues being dudes. Wow. Knight's Lightning Spear. <coughs> Ashen remains in which spirits yet dwell. You should summon the spirit of who? Knight Captain of the Black Knights. The Black Knights were the primary force of Mesmer's army. Second to their first knight commander was who? A man with agile command of both twin blade techniques and the powers of the Crucible, and whose spirit in these ashes dwells. Though a champion of the Divine Beast Hunt, he followed his father Andreas into rebellion against Mesmer. And like his father too, or like his father, he too was imprisoned in an underground tomb. Mesmer mourned the loss of a brother in arms. One of the incantations of the capital's ancient dragon cult summons a lightning spear while also manifesting ancient dragon crests. On throwing the spear, the crests will launch additional spears, charged to increase the number of crests. An incantation that was taught only to the most accomplished knights and now a lost art in the lands between. That's sick. Be wary of right, be wary of right, be wary of right. Thank you, messages. Hidden path ahead, you liar. Likely hidden path ahead, still no hidden path. <laughs> uh, okay, is there now? Here's the thing is there a switch? That can turn off the dude. Can I turn off his eyeballs, please? Or am I just cursed to forever see them? That's very odd. You would think there would be some way of stopping them. But I guess not. At least not from here. Let me do the go up thing. Oh, oops. Missed that. My bad. Wait, is that... is this something? No, okay. 
Oh, lovable sword. Imped. <laughs> nice. Head covering made from the largely unaltered head of an impish golem. Resembling a lion in appearance, life force faintly clings to it. Okay. So that's that. Now, let me try to get up to that other one. Let me try this out. Oh my goodness, this is painful. I guess I'm gonna wait now. Let's go for it. Yes, W. Dung. Wrath. <laughs> Anywhere else I can go here? Am I just... I think that's all. Hide, 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 hide. Do I have a Deathlight thing? Yeah. Levius Deathlight, but Deathlight build up. Okay. I'm just gonna go. I can come from the beginning again and and look at like look through the beginning of this dungeon later. Let's go down. Oh, let's take America. Is that a checkpoint stick of America, or is it a boss? Fear ahead. Ugh. There's more? What? 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 Oh. My goodness. This is terrifying. This is so scary. Honestly, for real. This is horrifying. Ugh. I hate that so much. It's okay. I can avoid their gaze like this. Oh boy. There's a... There's a dude. Is it? Here it comes. Man, that's disgusting. Whoa. Why did the camera do that? <laughs> Don't, don't, don't even. Let me heal when I'm in a situation like that. Okay. Oh. This is scary. Be wary of fire butthole. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my goodness. Hey, it, it blocks all damage from it though. That's kind of crazy. What is bro doing? Like I, I received no damage from that as fire. I could just hold up my shield and block it all. Glove wart four, bro. Try luring out. Oh, yikes. Uh, I'm looking for. Okay, okay, okay. Yep, 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 yep. Oh my goodness, whoa. I'm just going in, I don't care. 
Never mind, never mind. I I do care actually. Come here, bros. Wow, okay. This is a little bit much. I'm a teeny tiny bit scared. It's okay, I'm good at this game. There's a ladder. Why'd he stop? That's more scary than if he just kept going. Oh, what is... What is this? Why would I need an alcove? Oh, that's why. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, they're coming back. Oh, they come back quickly. Oh. Let's go. And I have no way of stopping them, but that's fine. Does this go further down? This catacomb is massive. This is definitely the scariest catacomb in the game. All right, I'm gonna follow them back this way. How do I get up there? I don't even know how to get up there. There's gotta be a way to get up there from here. I'm gonna assume. Probably this this ladder possibly? Ooh, legendary item. Why are they baiting me with oh boy. Okay, you know what? I'm honestly I'm honestly happy to see normal basilisks after everything that this dungeon has thrown at me. I can deal with normal basilisks. Normal basilisks I can just either fight or run away from. The perpetually watching eyeball ones, I cannot. I'm just gonna leave. I, I don't have the... I don't have the, the patience for this. Oh, I shouldn't have gone down there. That's where the basilisks are. Come here. There you go. Feels good to just kill some of you. Even if I can't kill the ones that are statues. I'm just gonna keep going. Bridge ahead, therefore down required ahead? Should I jump down the bridge? Is that a thing I should do? Can I jump down the bridge? Ooh. Oh, wait. Let me try. Oh. Sick. That was intended. Wait, did that guy just kill himself? He did. That's a bottomless pit, my dude. Please tell me this will lead me up to the... Be wary of up sniper ahead. Oh, boy. What are we looking at? I'm trying to get my bearings. Oh no. No. Come here. Come here. Walk to me. That's it. That's it.
Ancient Dragon Knight's Cookbook 2. Uh, so I'm safe here, actually, currently. A record of crafting techniques of the Ancient Dragon Knight who followed Godwin's Golden Knights into the Realm of Shadow. Dragon Bolt Grease and Drawstring Dragon Bolt Grease. Is that like extra lightning stuff? Yeah. Inflicting heavy lightning damage. That's what I thought. Got it. Okay. So that... Oh. Wait, have I been here before? This is the first... Yes. I have been here before. This is the first one with the eyeballs. Actually, I'm just gonna... Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. These halls aren't so scary. It's the... Oh, hey, Max. What's up? This is one of the most terrifying catacombs I've, I'm in. See these eyeballs? If they see me, it'll build up my death blight meter. And if my death blight meter fills, I just die instantly. And there's some that are, like, patrolling the halls. There's some that are just watching over these massive areas. This is... This is terrifying. Alright, I didn't figure out how to get up there. I'm not going to even try because these guys are just annoying. I'm just going to leave. Ow. Like, there's another one up here. I have to wait for it to come this way. There we go. Then I have to follow it from behind. Go, 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 go. Hang a right. There we go. Let's keep going. This has been a very long catacomb as well. I like the big ones. Hidden path? Liar. Yeah, they just... Po oh! I finally made it to the boss. Okay, well I have five heals. Maybe not going to win this first try, but let's try. Oh, another Death Knight. Oh, sick. The Death Knights are so cool. Let me pull out Tish for this. Just just this run. Because I don't have enough health to, to actually win this. At least not on my own for this first run, because I have five heals. And no physic blast. Whoa, whoa! Into phase two already. He's gonna steal all my health and heal back to full health. Yep, 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 yep. That's how he does these things. That's how he works. Super sick design, though. The other one I fought was... I think the exact same as this one. Oh, sick. Let's go. Oh, nope. I knocked him out of the stun. Great. Of course. Of course I did. There we go. Wait, am I gonna win this? With no heals left? Nope, that's the grab. Oh, yep, nope. Okay, I'm not winning this. Never mind. And he's back to 75% health. I'm so scared right now. I'm I'm blocking so hard. Ow. 
Haha, <laughs> there's a pillar. Yep, there it is. Okay, alright. Oh. Hey, I did pretty well for five heals. The goal for now is... Uh, do this and beat the final boss. I'm I'm literally like almost done with everything. I have to do this catacomb and then I have to find a way to get up to this little red part. I saw a ramp leading up and then after that I'll have done everything. I, I think. At least everything that I can see. And then it's final boss. So I'm almost done with, with the DLC. It's pretty cool. I am uh, almost almost 40 hours. That's insane for a DLC. <laughs> oh, of course, right as I summon, you're gonna lightning right off the bat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me get my runes, please. Now that I have my, my deflect, I can... I can hit him with... Hit him with the deflex, and there we go. Knock him out of the stuns more easily. Right, he's gonna go into phase two. I have to knock it grab. There we go. Let's go. So easy. Let's go. I could have done that without Tish, but I did it with her. It's fine. I just wanted to go faster. All right, let's see what we got. Death Knight's Long Haft Axe. A long Haft and Golden Axe wielded by the Death Knight. Bears a representation of a decayed golden ring. Crackles with lightning the power of the capital's ancient dragon cult. The Knight, once the personal guard of Godwin, was also the protector of the Prince of Death's cadaver surrogate. Prince of Death is Godwin. Uh, Blink Bolt. With the... Ooh! From a low stance, the body is transformed into a bolt of lightning and charges straight ahead at fulgurous speed. Strong attack performs a lightning charge, leaping slash. A medallion with cerulean amber inlaid boosts maximum FP by the utmost. Oh, okay. Uh, the Urtree's old sap becomes amber, treasured as the most precious of jewels in the age of God for the first Elden Lord. These medallions of the largest variety were conferred to Godwin's inner circle of distinguished golden knights. And now I have one, because I'm cool. Get me out of this place. If there's something cool in here, I'll look it up and I'll figure it out later. I don't want to spend one more second in this catacomb that I don't have to. Whew. Okay, so now I go back to here and then I need to head south and find the way up the ramp. And then after that, it's final boss. This is, this is literally it. I probably won't beat him tonight because it's getting a little late for me. It is past midnight, but I'll give it a few attempts. We'll see. I've done a little bit of practice on phase one off stream, and I can do it basically without taking any damage. I'm gonna get. Yep. I'm gonna. Yep. 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 Stop. 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 I'm stuck. I'm stuck on a rock. I'm stuck on a rock. I hate these guys. I'm just, I'm leaving. I'm drinking my flask. And I'm running. I'm gonna go around, see if I can kill... Hello? Okay. Any more of these birds real? Those are statues. Those are both statue. Oh, this one's real. <laughs> uh, nice. And I got the Gravebird armor, finally. Stone armor with a tinge of green. Again, where? One of a set of armor pieces cast in the image of a Gravebird, featuring a cape of black deathbird feathers. It enhances jumping attacks. Gravebirds are all ancient golems created to guard the spirit graves built where all manners of death ultimate. 
ultimately drift. Okay. So, there's one more thing up there. Actually, I don't think I can get there from here. I might have to drop down from there. Because this looks... Yeah. No, I can't get there from here. Okay. I'm going to try going from here. No, actually... No. Wait. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna go here. I had like north, northeast a little bit. Now that I can see this on the map. Oh, it's that. Oh, oh. Oh, I've been to that. I know where that is. That's where I got the sword. Okay. So, I've, that yeah, that is everything. Well, let's go to the final boss. <laughs> where is this? I forget. I, I think it's this one. One incredible DLC. Let's go. Wait, can I level up? I think I can. Give me a second. Where, where's the crate? There it is. <laughs> oh. Here we go. Here we go. Trying to do phase one hitless. messed up the first one sorry i got a little greedy i'm forgetting how how i did this attempt two this is it this is it for real this time i promise Run to the left, run to the left, run to the left, and jump! He's gonna do the gravity pull. Oh. Nope, he's doing the lion's claw attack. That's fine. Dodge around him. Don't want to get hit by the blood flame. I messed up. Why did I do that? I had my shield up, excuse me. I'm getting greedy. I'm, get, I'm trying to get hits in when I know I can't. This is fun, though. First phase is really fun. And I've heard phase two is a nightmare, but I haven't gotten far enough to find out. Oh, come on. I was so close I got hit by that. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. Is he going to do the gravity pull? Nope. Wow, not even... He's not going to do two of those. That's so much fun. That's, that's such a good attack to punish him. I shouldn't have done that. But it's fine. Okay. Oh, he did it. Oh, boy. Wow. I panicked. I missed one thing and then I panicked. I should have healed that other time instead of trying to hit him.
I think I need to do more damage. I think I need to maybe try a new build. Oh, I didn't. Wow, uh, here, dude, kill me. I didn't, I didn't use my flask. I didn't even use my flask, dude. I shouldn't have even healed there. No. Oh, come on, dude. That's annoying. I blocked that. I totally blocked that. What in the world was that? Wow, wow, wow. I'm not even at half health when we get phase two. Okay. Alright, check out this phase two cutscene. This is insane. Phase two is wild. I'm trying not to get hit, but you're about to see in phase two, it's very hard to not get hit <laughs> with what he pulls out here now. <sighs> okay, Radon. Moog's body with Radon's soul in it. Lord Brother. It's Mikola himself. He's finally here. This is the first time we see Mikola in the whole game. I'm just, I'm spamming these screenshots. This is so sick. <laughs> this music is so good. Bro, it's so good. He's gonna do the little... Alright, he's about to nuke the entire arena. I need to heal, but I don't have time to. I don't know why he went into phase 2 when he still has like 60% health left. That's a little bit annoying. Okay, uh, I'm gonna check something real quick. Do I have the weapon that I'm thinking of? I think it's Blood Fiend's arm that I'm thinking. Would I rather be, seeing, would I rather be a sea tortoise for the rest of my life? Or be exactly as I am now, but I have to carve Cory number 1 or 400 and else lose 19 IQ points? Um... Uh... Uh... Probably the second one. Not sure about that though. That's that's a stupid one. Oh, I forgot about the I can't believe I forgot about that. I'm actually so stupid. Come here, buddy. Oh, now I can do a second one? Okay.
I need to heal. I'm gonna heal right now after this. Yep, perfect. There we go. Get staggered, bro. Champion of the festival, more like you suck at the festival. I don't know. Oh, jeez. Yep. Goodbye. Uh, I don't want to summon Anz back because he gets more health. Or Don has more health if I summon Anz back. I'm trying to do this solo. If I summon anybody to help me, they're just going to die. There we go. W? Half W. Okay, I, I need to block the blood flame there instead of... Wow. I'm playing this so badly, actually, for real. Oh, come on. He, like, he never does that second attack. Almost, almost never. I was way too close there. My bad. Do a flip, do a flip. Yes. Do a second one. Yes. Thank you. Don't do a third. Yes. Thank you. Oops. Don't do a second one. Sick. Easily punishable attack. Let's go. Wow, bro. Alright, Mikola, you're going down. Never mind, I thought he was doing the nuke. He's not doing the nuke. I'm dead. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, I need a new... I need a new tactic for this. So, my thinking is, right now, I may try this, uh, but... I've heard that this weapon... Where is it? Blood Fiend's arm? Yeah, right here. This weapon is really good. Capable of spraying blood stored within when executing a strong attack. So it does, like, blood stuff. But it's apparently really good for lots of damage. So I might try respecting into this and just seeing what happens. I think I'm going to try that. Just for funsies, you know? Just for fun. We'll find out. I don't know if this is going to work, really, but let's give it a try. <laughs> Okay. Oh jeez, I forgot about that. I always forget about that. Why do I always forget about that? Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. There's the blood loss. Sick. That's so sick. This is why it's better to play smarter, not harder. Wow.
I, yeah, I messed that up. This is working really well, actually. This is working surprisingly well. I'm I'm very happy with this, actually. If I can get this to work with the with the Mikola phase, this might work super super well. I might beat him tonight. We'll find out. What's he gonna do? Do a flip, please. Thank you. Do a second one, please. Nope. Nice. This is kind of working though. This is kind of working. That first that first phase was was faster because I just have more damage output. Nice. I messed up. Oh wow, I messed that up. I almost never messed that up. No, 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 no. Dang it. That's not what I wanted. Wow. Yeah, I, if for some reason, it, he did another strong attack. I did another strong attack.
Oh, come on. Really? Didn't even let me get my second thing off? Wow, that's insane. How am I supposed to do damage to this dude? Wow, that's kind of crazy. Sick, sick, let's go, okay. That's kind of insane. I didn't, I didn't hit another R2 on that. What in the world was that? I didn't hit another R2. I straight up didn't do that. I hit one charge at R2. That was it. There was not another one queued up. I don't know why he did that. Why I did that. I'm blaming my character. That was not my fault. I would have had that too. That was a really good run. Let's see if I can do that again. It's really all about the RNG. It's really like what he does at the beginning of the fight, basically. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm straight up going to die. Oh, no, okay, 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 alright. What are you gonna do? Come get me. Yeah, that's what I thought. Come get me, bro. Nice. What? I'm trying to pull my shield up. No, dude, no. Okay, that was that combo, but then I messed it up. But that that was my fault because I didn't think about the the upper pull. I thought he was doing a different combo. My bad. I'll take credit for that. But this is very doable. This is this is fun. Dare I say. Alright, I'm messing this up big time. Come get me. I took the risk that he wasn't going to do too, but of course he did too. That I can punish. Nice. How in the world do I... I don't even know how I avoid that, dude. Uh, oops, oops, oops. I hit the wrong button. 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 That's my bad. 
Yeah, if I die first phase, it's absolutely my fault. Don't do a second. Nice. Sick, okay. There we go. Okay, okay, I'm I'm trying to play differently here for some reason. <clears throat> and it's not going well for me. Oh I didn't I didn't use my flask, I didn't use my flask, of course. No, he's gonna come for me the exact second I Yep. Yep, because I didn't use my flask, he knows it. So he's gonna just he's gonna just kill me. Don't do a second, I'm doing it, yep. Nice. I was banking on the fact that, that that jump attack would stun. And it did. What in the world? I can't even... Bro, this sucks. Actually, for Big Bonk purposes... Let's try the Mimic tier. <laughs> this could this could go either very well or very horribly. Uh, I kind of like these Talismans as they are. I'm also going to put on... Where's Mikola's Rune? Here we go. Mikola's Rune just in case I get grabbed. Because that negates the grab debuff that you get. Or he steals your heart and you die instantly. Just for fun, let's let's try mimic tier right now. Wow. I don't even- I'm dead. Sick. Let's go. Let's do it! Thank you, my beautiful Mimic Tier. My beautiful boy Mimic Tier. Oh, look at how close he is, dude. I think this is it. I think this is... I think this is how we do it. Wait, did he just... Did he just rocket into the sky like he does in his fight? I have not seen that move. To be fair, I've not seen much of his second phase. That is really, really funny though. This is so doable. I, I can win this tonight with this build. I'm going to take my time with phase one because I can. I messed that up. Can't believe how badly I messed that up. Jeez. 
hit the complete wrong button. I hit R2 instead of L1. <laughs> oh, I messed that up so badly, dude. That was that was such a brain fart phase. It's not even funny. <laughs> uh, let's keep going. This is a fun fight when you have a good build, though. You just have to be hyper aggressive in phase two. Let's go. I think I'm summoning Mimic 2 right now, actually. No, that was a bad idea. Okay, don't summon Mimic 2 until phase 2. Or until right before phase 2 or something like that. I hit, I hit the summon Mimic 2 button. That was my mistake. I'm very sorry. I apologize. This run is dead. Yep. I'm used to summoning Mimic Tier immediately as battles start, so actually right now, let's go. Try me. You won't. <laughs> I'm, I'm playing extremely riskily here, just, just trying to see what will happen, just for fun, you know? the entire nuke because of that. That's so sick. Oh, he's... He, he's up in the sky. Where is he? Where is he? Help, 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 help. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious, Radon. That was insane. Okay, this is doable. This is doable. That's twice now that I've gotten down to pretty low health. If I can stun him once again, he'll be dead. If I can stun him again, it's over. It's just actually doing that and pulling that off successfully. That's the problem. <laughs> oh my goodness, why did you do that? Jump. Let's go. It worked. I'm summoning the Mimic to you right after this, right now. Let's go. That was a bad idea. I'm trying to play too riskily is my, is my thing. I keep trying to summon this stupid thing. I could have had that stagger if I had just gone for the jump attack, but I, I got too scared. That's always such a risky move. Thanks for letting me heal. I'm, just, I'm going for the jump attack. Let's go. Oh, okay. Didn't get the stagger off, but I did get the heal off. Missed. I need some stamina back. That's mainly why I did that. I'm summoning Mimic Tear. Ow, jeez. <laughs> Forgot that has an AoE thing, because I'm never that close to him when he does it. 
I always just hit him and then move on with my life. Let's go. Let's go. Big, 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 big numbers. Try to mimic here. I have my shield up, but okay. I'm trying to see if there's like a good opening to get the Mimic Tier in, but he's just too fast. Even after a stun, you can't get him. I'm just testing out different Mimic Tier summon openings. Okay, now I can summon because he didn't do his attack right off the bat. I shouldn't summon moves here for later so it has enough health to survive. I should really- I should pull out the shield for phase 2, actually. I should pull out the shield, because I'm doing phase 1 no shield. To get more damage, but I think- I think shield phase 2 is better, because then I can block the holy attacks. I think that's the strat. Let's try it. Summon Mimic tier. Just gonna drink up, just to be safe. Mimitir got that attack in too. Let's go, super sick. Pulling out the shield for this one. Oh, he's going for the nuke. Oh no, he's not, never mind. Dodged it. Yes, pay attention to Mimitir, thank you. So close. If I can stagger him, I think he's dead. Oh, he's 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 up in the sky. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. Da -da 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 -da. This is it. This is it. Oh, this music is so sick. I adore this music so much. It's so beautiful. He's dead. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! That was so much fun. That's kind of a crazy... Kind of a crazy phase. Not gonna die. Ooh, ooh. Let us go together. Is that a... Let us go together. Ooh. That's cool. Touch memory. What is this? An ending cutscene? Oh, no. 
I kind of feel circlet of light. I kind of feel a little bad for killing him, possibly. Why is it always Lord? I think maybe he had good intentions, but I really don't know. Let's see what we got. Remembrance of a god and a lord. Remembrance of Radon, consort of Mikola, hewn into the scattered tree. In their childhood, Mikola saw in Radon a lord, his strength and his kindness that stood in stark contrast with their afflicted selves. And so Mikola made his heartfelt wish that Radon would one day be his king consort. And he almost was. The circlet of light which adorned Mikola's head as he returned in divine aspect, it has begun to fade into nothingness. Slightly boost intelligence, faith, and arcane while also, also boosting the power of Mikola's light. The circle was to be the very foundation upon which Mikola's age of compassion would be built, should it have ever come to pass. Wow. No, the Age of Compassion is dead. I might play around with this build some more, because this is kind of crazy. But overall... That will probably do it for the- ooh! Hands back? <gasps> Aww. Aww. Furious Blade of Hands back. Sorry I didn't summon you, dude, but like, I'm not going to deal with that. I'm not going to have extra health. Wise Man's Mask, the Iron Mask of Sir Anne's back, giving the appearance of a quiet, wise, old, bearded man. But an old fear lurks beneath, together with the cold, unflinching discipline that once honed his blade, now employed to enhance blood oath and dynastic skills. Hmm. What's he afraid of? Moog being taken? Not having a purpose? A tire of Sir Anne's back, the embroidered crest of the pure blood knights, has now all but faded away, slightly enhances blood oath and dynastic skills. Ansbach understood that keeping his oath to his old master was not an act of logic, nor would it bear any justice, but it was for these very reasons he was unable to let go. Yeah, he was... This says all the same thing, okay. He was trying to save Moog. Because that was Moog's body with Radon's soul in it. Signature weapon of the pure blood knight Ansbach, a viciously keen and slender scythe made for combat. The obsidian edge relies not upon trickery to fulfill its violent purpose, Though skill alone, the wielder can rip and rend through. F oh, through skill alone, the wielder can rip and rend through foes, sowing blossoms of red upon the battlefield. Dynastic sickle play, a finessed evasive skill that creates space to maneuver. Inputs dictate direction of the backstep. Follow up with a strong attack to perform an advancing slash, advancing upward slash. Press strong attack again to bring the weapon back down. Incantation of Anne's back, pure blood knight, produces a blood flame blade from the side of the hand and lunges at enemies to cleave through them. Oh, cool. Charge to increase the number of slashes. Markedly different from the finessed swordplay of the dynast, this is an aggressive last resort of an incantation that gave rise to Ansbach's fearsome reputation. Wow. That's crazy. I don't even need this because I'm too good. I, I, just, I just don't get grabbed. There's not going to be any other weird things chilling around the arena, huh? Probably not. Let me go up here and see what this actually is. That was unexpected. <laughs> the second I open the map, I like run into it and it shatters. Behold, guard counter. Yeah, that's... That's how I beat him. <laughs> guard counter. Oh, I can't get up here? Dang it. Behold, tarnished. Praise the shield, so to speak. Praise the piercing. Let me in. Let me in! Yeah, I might have to mess around with this blood build, because that could be insane. Big blood bonk boy weapon. I think that's it. Ugh, oh, man, I wish I could go up there. Wow, what a game, dude. What a game. <laughs> that was... That was everything I could ever want in a DLC. 
cannot wait to play it again. Whoa! You get three things. Great Sword of Radon Lord. Great Swords of Black Steel, wielded by Radon in his youth. A pair of weapons decorated with the lion mane motif. These were in pos these were in his possession immediately before his triumph of the stars. The swords of a lord who does not rely on physical strength and gravity alone. <clears throat> Promise consort. Imbue the two great swords with the light of Mikola, then deliver a slashing attack accompanied by columns of light. Additional input allows for two follow-up attacks. Cool. This is the same thing, but a different attack. Light speed slash. Assume a luminous form and leap forward to deliver a downward slash at the speed of light. This attack will be followed up by an additional light attack. Charge to increase power of the skill and number of follow-up attacks. That's cool. Light of Mikola. The strength of Mikola upon his deific return, wielded as an incantation, annihilates foes with a pillar of light. Mikola sought to accept all that was and would be, but found one that refused to be embraced. No wonder, as one god and one king consort, is all the world needs. So was Mikola in the right and we, we ruined it? I don't know. Kind of crazy. I'm going to get this, actually, instead of the swords. What equipment can I get? Mesmer's Helm, absolutely. Just trying to see what other... Gaius' armor... Veteran's Helm, that's Gaius's... No, that, that, that's Commander Nile. Gaius's Helm. The Black Iron Helm of Commander Gaius, part of an armor set pattern after Fallen Seeds. Gaius was the most senior disciple of the same Alabaster Lord who taught Radon and Gaia gravitational technique. Oh, interesting. Young Lion's Helm, the golden helm worn by Radon in his younger years. Interesting. Proudly displaying his heroic red hair. It is fitting attire for a lion. When Melania Blade of Mikola let the rot flower blossom in Aeonia, Radon heard a murmur in his ear. Mikola awaits thee, O promise consort. Oh. Oh, we know what what Melania said to Radon. Why did Mikola send Melania to fight Radon then? Or why was Melania fighting Radon? If it was part of his plan, Mikola awaits the Opromise Consort. That's so cool. I'm buying the, the DLC ones first. And then I'm going to just... Oh, no, no, no. I do not have enough money for all these. <laughs> Young Lion's Gauntlets. Gaius's Gauntlets. Rulana's Glow. I have that. And that's it. Okay. Um, wow. That's incredible. I'm going to go back to here, Gate of Divinity. What a game. This is literally my favorite game of all time. Man, that game was so perfect. I I loved everything about that DLC. I'm going to do a whole review video and everything later. I have like a very few negatives, but I don't think that takes away from uh, me rating this a 10 out of 10 DLC to an already 10 out of 10 game. Putting that together... I don't know how your math is, but that to me sounds like a 20 out of 10. And that's the best way that I can describe this game. It's a 20 out of 10. It's so perfect. I... Ugh. Man. Well, that was everything I wanted and more. <laughs> I'm gonna end this, so goodbye. See you later. Have a nice day.